Yes, you're welcome back. It's, it's a delight to welcome you to Heroic Academy. Okay, so this is to guide you on how to participate in Heroic uh, competition. Okay, we introduce Heroic competition to help students that are building application to, to perfect in their skill. Okay, now um, the first step is you make a choice of the comp of the project you want to build for example if you are a web development student and you are meant to build a web application you have to select the web application you want to build if you want to build a bank website e-commerce website a school website personal website business website any kind of website you want to build, you make a choice of it then you start building it <clears throat> okay then um, if you are building a front end, then you concentrate on the front end. If it is a front end competition, it depends on the competition we are working on. If you are working on the front end, you concentrate on the front end. If you are working on the back end, so the competition where where the competition will determine what, where you are going to concentrate. Okay, so if you are building mobile a mobile app, then you also build it if you are meant to build the front end you build the front end if you're meant to build the back end you build the back if you're meant to build the full stack that is the both the front end and back end you also do same do so okay and so also for graphic design because even though we started this uh, competition with the um web development but it's, it's going to continue with we're going to also do some competition for graphic designers and all and even Microsoft, those that are learning Microsoft Word and Excel, uh, gradually we get there. Okay, so this video is just a general guide for everything you need to know about the competition. All right, so that's it. So after building the project, these are the steps you're going to follow. After building it, you submit the project for me to edit. I will edit the project, make necessary corrections, then send you a video where I talked about the way you're going to effect co a, a corrections. Then you do the necessary corrections, the here and there. After that, you after that, then after you must have done the corrections I pointed out, then you follow this step. So the next thing you have to do is you vis visit our academy, heroicuniversity.com to get you to this place. Then click on ta talents. So when you click on talent, it will get you to our talent website. This is a website we use for our competition. Okay. Then the next thing is you you go to actually when you click on talent, that it will get you to this point. Actually, then you have to come here, click on register. Okay. Or you can click here. It will lead you to the home. Okay. Sorry, it will lead you to home page. Now we just click here. Click on register. So here now you will register, you type in your details, then you register. If you have participated in this competition before, it means that you have registered already. The, the next, if you've registered before, then just click on login. Okay, but if you've not registered, then you register first, then you click on login. So I will log in with my student so okay you are not yet registered okay i've not registered this one okay let me take this chance to register it so i'll just register quickly which is you nigerian and number number maybe south maybe south okay maybe south oh sorry i did i didn't actually start from the beginning um first name Uche last name Joseph surname Omoka phone number then email I think I've registered this email before let me use another email heroic um okay let me use Uche Joe oh, let me use admin at heroicuniversal.com password password 
then here you put the your skill the, your the talent or skill that you have maybe i will put just programming okay just to make you can separate if you have more you can separate with comma can okay motivating teaching okay and so on and so forth okay oh sorry my dear i put which joe here sorry about that I'm supposed to put my date of birth then nationality perfect mm. so this was like this before so it confused me so that it is how it's supposed to be so i think yes you've registered just click on register i can save this so that next time so you see congratulations you've registered successfully so click the button below to log in just click login then here now you type in admin at hirikuniversity.com then type in the password okay then you log in so when you log in get to this point please when you once you log in here try to go to your profile the first thing you're going to do here is update profile image very important very important please because your image will be used for for this competition just upload come here select your the image your image that you're going to upload let's check let me quickly uh, check my image just please the image you are going to use must be very neat very good image as an image that will be is it's not going to be image that will not uh, be clear it will be clear enough let me use this this one i will resize this image so that it will be easier to upload just click right click on it click on paint then you resize it you see this image is big you resize it give it like maybe let's say 40 not 40 but 400 400 pixel uh -oh. Sorry, it seems I get 4,000. Oh, sorry about that percentage. Oh my God, are you kidding me? 400 pixels, yeah. That's better, yeah. So this is the image, you save it. I'm going to save it as, I'm going to call it Uche Joe. Uche Joe, just save it. Okay, I already have Uche Joe, no? Maybe Uche Joe too awesome now let's go back again uh let's search for where i saved i saved it somewhere here right move down this is it here then you upload update it this is successfully updated so if you refresh now you are going to see the image here so do you see the image if you go back to your profile you see the image very important please do this first then after that then you come down to the next thing you're going to do before you even come here is to create go to your youtube channel i believe you have gmail if you don't have gmail create gmail then you 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 uh log into youtube youtube.com okay log into youtube.com then when you come here i'm logged in already okay but if you're not logged in you're going to see sign in here just click on sign in then you type in your gmail so it will log you into your youtube okay now once you're logged in you're going to see all these just click here click upload video okay then now and even before you come to this youtube please you have to i almost missed this very important one please you have to make a video explaining um you are going to make a video explaining your project okay you're going to make a video explaining your project the, uh, the, uh, these are key points you are going to mention number one you have to say your name please your name okay the second you're going to say that you are a student of heroic okay student just maybe web development student web development web dev student student okay of heroic academy okay then you now present the project that you are you want to talk about 
the project you build they mention maybe e-commerce project if it is e-commerce okay so you want to analyze the or showcase the e-commerce uh, e-commerce project e-commerce websites okay just mention the website you built okay mention the website you built uh, that you want to showcase the websites you built okay for the competition that, that the front uh, that we normally organize front end competition so you, uh, you build this website to participate in the front end competition okay then after that then you now start talking about the website you start mentioning the features of the website but make sure limit your limit your video to 10 minutes don't allow it to exceed 10 minutes please okay just just point out some essential features of your website start from menu from menu then from every other thing you build yourself just take your time but please make sure that your video is that your audio is that you have a good audio okay you have good audio uh, record your screen why doing this record your screen with this app screen recorder where is it screen recorder uh, screen recorder use OCAM. Let me look for it. OCAM. OCAM. This is it. OCAM. If you don't have it, download it with Google. Uh, go to Google and download it. OCAM. Download OCAM. OCAM. Okay. So you are going to see OSoft. Then click on it. Let me see if we can get it from here. OSoft. Yes, that is it. Perfect. Okay. Then it will open then you download it let's look for where you can download this is it just click here it will download when it downloads then you install it to your computer and use it to record the, the screen that is what i'm using to record your screen okay use it to record your screen while presenting your website and uh, while doing that make sure that your video your volume that your voice is clear that someone can hear you clearly these are some mistakes some of my, my students made some of my students they made these mistakes why building why presenting in, in our in our past competition please don't make the same mistake make sure that your voice is hard is clear no it's unambiguous okay just your name the academy heroic that's your student of heroic academy a web development student of heroic academy then that um okay then you now present all the uh, the features of your website okay then after that end up by encouraging people encourage uh, web development prospects web prospects to join heroic students to join heroic students so encourage them let them know that online training with online training that they can actually learn and become ex experts okay just end with that then your video is ready so make sure you are done with the video first before going to youtube okay now you can now come and upload the video okay then i okay i have some videos i'm going to upload now let me quickly upload them the ones that are still remaining i've uploaded some so the videos of these corrections all these corrections i made one two three i think from here to here i'm gonna upload okay i'm still making this one it's not done down okay, let me upload this too okay drag it here good so it will start uploading baby on your own case in your own case you are going to upload only single one so you need to follow a certain procedure let me show you the procedure if i click here now it will show like this very good here you're going to type in the name of the project please why type in it just type in if it's an e-commerce shop don't, just type in e-commerce project okay good then come here click here i mean no it's not meant for kids if you want anyone can serve anyway is it meant for kids let me say yes or no is it meant for kids uh, let me read about it. Say features like personalized ad and notification won't be available on videos made for kids. They are set made for kids by you. I'm more likely to recommend that long. Okay. So if you want it to be recommended for kids, then you leave it. If you don't want, 
I mean, if you don't want it, click no. Okay, let me click no. It's not meant for kids. Click here. Next. Next. And then you have to make it public. Okay. Public. Very good. So you are done. Just click close. But before you close it, copy this. Copy this link because we're going to use this link. Then you close it. It means that you are done with this one. You've copied the link and go back to Heroic Academy. So when you come back here now, you just click on upload video. Okay. From here now, you type in the title of the video, title of your of your video, which is is going to be the title of your website. Call it. Let's say if you build e-commerce website, just call it e-commerce website or e-commerce web project do not say let's say if you are uche joe for example do not say uche joe's e-commerce website no don't say that just say e-commerce website the reason is because uh uche joe will be that your name will be below it no need putting your name first just put just call it the name of that project okay don't put your name there all right uh, if it's a personal website you can now if you if it's your personal website that you created you can say Uche Joe, for example, if it's my personal website, I can say Uche Joe's personal website. It's well understood. Otherwise, if it's not a personal website, call it, if it's a business website, for example, just say business web project. Simple. Okay? So that is it. Then put it here. Then category, leave front end as it is. Then here now, this is where you are now going to paste that YouTube you copied. Okay? Then, after that, please. Come here, you're going to create, I didn't mention this one is very important, video thumbnail. You know, when you go to YouTube, you're going to see that, let's visit YouTube again. You're going to see that each of the videos have images, you see. All these videos have images. So you're going to use graphic design to create, you're going to design an image for your own, for your uh, presentation, design an image okay that you're going to use all right and use this size please why design and use this size? let me show you youtube uh thumbnail size good let me show you the size you're going to use this you you're going to use 1080 pixel by 720 pixel that's the resolution okay 1080 pixel by 720 pixel that's what i'm going to use if you don't know how to set it up like this just download one YouTube just say um, YouTube YouTube uh, maybe you can just search YouTube thumbnail sample like this sample design something like this then you see maybe this one okay copy it I mean save it so when you save it now okay I've saved this before after saving it you can now copy it put it in your graphic graphic design application then use the size the way it is now to create your or make your own to be the same size once you're able to use this size you've gotten what i want okay then after designing it you convert it to bitmap you convert it to jpeg then the, the only thing you need to write there you know you don't need to write much you can put your image if you want to if you don't want to leave out your image you can put any other image that reflect your project the project you built then you now come and write let's see if it's an e-commerce project that you build you write e-commerce web project simple maybe maybe by down here you might write by so so so, so or you leave it just e-commerce web project simple make it big like you see you see example of the design this is another design here <coughs> you understand this is another design so you can just download different youtube design so that it will help you to design your own to look great okay the what is more important to me is this size maintain this size make sure you use this as a uh, I mean aspect ratio maintain this aspect ratio very important then after that you upload it upload your thumbnail okay after uploading the thumbnail that's your web project that you have edited convert it to zip file the same way you converted it to zip file and sent to me convert it to zip file and the click on browse and select it and upload 
okay then after that click on upload video that's all you need to do once you are done with uploading the video maybe i will upload one video to show you example let's say sample sample project project title okay i just want to just then this one i will upload any image mm, yeah upload this image i just downloaded right okay then a copy just upload any zip file look for a zip file okay yeah this one think that's okay mm -hmm. then i'll just upload then you see successfully uploaded then the after uploading you're going to see the image the video that you uploaded okay then down here you're going to see that you are going to be instructed to copy the link below to share it with your friends so this link is what you're going to copy use it to promote your project share it with your friends okay tell your friends to come and vote for you so if you share it with your friend if they open it this is what they are going what they are going to see do you see whenever your friends when your friends open this they're going to see it like this see the website they see this and this is the the, the look of your project they can vote for you they can click here or here to vote for you do you get that so that is it so you just take the link share with your friends tell them to come and vote for you that you created a certain website uh, for to compete in a competition of heroic academy that you built it that you want them to vote for you okay then you drop the link that they should click on the link to vote so when they click on the link it will lead them to this place where they will see your details okay they will now vote for you so the a person three persons with the highest votes win the ten thousand that's ten thousand will be divided for the three first person will win five thousand second person three thousand the third person two thousand okay we just know that it's not just about the money what's more important is your that you are improving okay that you are improving that improvement is so so important okay so these are the presentation made by our previous i mean our former students some of them are also participating in this one too those are <coughs> so um if you if you go through this you're going to see the, the way they presented even though they made some mistakes so learn from their mistakes make your own presentation better please do your best i wish you luck thank you so much so immediately you are done with all this start promoting do not wait for other people because the competition i will soon announce the end of this competition i will soon tell i will tell you when the competition will end so do not waste time start promoting so our people will start voting for you fast okay thank you so much